Mexicans getting back to work and off unemployment. The number of people filing for first-time unemployment is dropping, but how much? News 13's Jackie Kent is live at the Department of Workforce Solutions with why the department doesn't have clear numbers. Jackie. Kim, salons, gyms, and restaurants for dine-in reopened on Monday, but the Department of Workforce Solutions says it could still be weeks before we know how many people are going back to work. We're at the point now where we've got roughly a thousand people still applying every day, and there are some people that are going back to work, but for a myriad of fairly complicated reasons, it's hard for us to track that number as is. Today, Department of Workforce Solutions Secretary Bill McCamley says the state is currently paying benefits to 130,000 New Mexicans compared to about 10,000 before the pandemic. More than 5,800 people filed for first time unemployment this week. That's down 3,600 from last week. The number of people actually getting benefits this week is thousands less than the number filing those first time claims. But McCamley says that doesn't necessarily mean that's how many people are going back to work. He says there's not a good way to track the reasons for people getting off of unemployment. And you have a lot of people in the system that are certifying for multiple weeks. So the amount of certifications doesn't really show uh, the amount of people that are on unemployment completely or going back to work. McCamley says the number of people who went back to work as more businesses opened this week is not reflected in this week's totals because the workers won't report to the system until Sunday. They're also not taken off the unemployment rolls for three weeks. We also asked if there's a way for Workforce Solutions to track how many people have been offered their jobs back with the same hours and wages, but refused because they make more off of unemployment. McCamley says that employers can report those instances on an online form on their website. Back to you. Okay, thanks, Jackie. Now, on Monday, the Department of Workforce Solutions is hosting a virtual town hall with employers to answer questions about the rules for going back to work.